Hey farmers, what's going on? Welcome back to another Hey Dave video. And in this video, we're going to be talking about the mailbox, Alfred the Postman, and thank you letters. So let's get started. I'm going to be starting the game. Let's have a look at the event that we're having today. It's the puzzle piece event. You're going to get up to five of the puzzle pieces for your sanctuary. Fortunately, I've already completed my puzzle book, so I don't need them anymore. All right, so my boat is here. I'm going to be collecting the products that I've been making. So we have the new product. This is the bacon uh, cheese fondue. Let's um, fill some crates. Um, I can do this iced tea, and we've got this bright bouquet. And then I'm just going to be asking for help. And let's advertise my shop. I can't stay advertising my shop. It's like a compulsory part. I always have to do this. All right, there we go. And let's collect some coins. I've been selling some vegetables. All right, let's just try some crops from here. I've got some soybeans and sugar cans. So let's see what do we get right now. All right, and I got a nail. Don't need that though. All right, I think it's going to be a nail or anything else. Ooh, an X. So what do I need right now? Let's see. I think I'm going to go with some pineapples because I'm really low on them. And I'm going to plan to let's see what I can go with. I'm going to go with cucumbers. A lot of crops in Haiti now. It's getting kind of hard to manage all of them. So, oh my god, my feed meal is stopped. We have Rose here and she's saying that I'm on a discount. Nope, I don't have enough diamonds. I can't hire you now. Go. I think I need to put some more feeds in there. Let's put some pig feed. And if I can collect my animals. I can collect some milk, I can collect some bacons, oh these are chickens, not the bacons, eggs, and I have to feed them now. I kind of forget when I hire Rose, I forget to feed my animals on my own, because when you have hired Rose, uh, she does all the work so you don't have to do anything, it's really helpful. Oh my god, I need to feed my pets, right? No, I think they're okay, I'm just kind of confused. So I got a... Someone help my boat, so we can run my sugar mill. Let's go to my town and see what's going on in there. I'm going to collect my townies and serve them. All right, there we go. Keep collecting and collecting and collecting. All right. I'm also getting close to level up to 151 and I'm so excited. I can't wait to level up now. And my barn is full. We're just going to be... All right, so this was a thank you letter that I just sent from because somebody helped my town and I sent them a thank you letters. So now let's collect this. Nope, it's locked. I can't do anything. I'm going to go ahead and pick some townies so that I can serve them. I always go with the ones that take less time. For example, um, the diner, the beach cafe, gift shop. I don't really pick the bed and breakfast and, um, spa because the town is take a lot of time, especially in the bed and breakfast. It takes about four hours, even if your um, bed and breakfast is fully maxed. Otherwise, it would take about eight hours, which I think is a lot of time. And you can't sit there just waiting for them to get ready. It's annoying. It's really annoying. So now I'm going to be sending them to their building so that I can serve them. Let's start. All right. Gonna start from here. Okay, come on. So I'm getting a lot of townies now. Oh my god, what's going on? going to send them now. Nope, my diner is full. And it's time to serve my beautiful townies now. Let's see if I can or not. Alright, that's juice. We come to the diner. Soup, cake, pancake, strawberry cake, pie, and the potato bread. So potato bread again. That was the banana bread. We've got some smoothie and juice. I'm going to ask for help because I only got two and I don't want to waste them. 
Nope, let's ask for help. I don't really mind asking for help in the town. I mean, I just put help whenever I need. We can do this, we can do this. I'm getting low. Oh my god, I don't have any olives. Now you guys see that I've put the help, and if someone will um, help my townies, I will send them a thank you letter, which will hold gift cards inside it. So I'm going to get back to my farm, and I'm going to be showing you guys my mailbox, which has been full for so many days, and I haven't collected them. I was just waiting um, to show you guys how it works, so we're just going to get back to my farm. The game is taking a really long time to load, and I just have no idea why. Alright guys, so this is how your mailbox looks like, which is close to the Wheel of Fortune and the Tom. So apparently the mailbox has two shapes. It looks like this when it's full with the thank you letters and you cannot collect any more. For example, you guys can see these are all the gift cards that people have been sending me and you can read them as well. Um, big thanks, you are the best, thanks for helping. Moochie, appreciated, roses are red, roses are blue, sugar is sweet and so are you. Wow, that's really cool. And it looks like this when there are no thank you letters inside it. So you can see it's totally empty. There's not a sign of a single paper. But we are just going to go ahead and see how does these thank you letters come into our mail mailbox. Well, Alfred the Postman is the man who works and delivers all the thank you letters that you collected by helping people that I'll show you guys later in the video. But we're going to see how Alfred works. All right, guys, so you can see a person on a scooter, and that is your postman, Alfred. Now, Alfred was added back in April 2014, and since then, he's been working really hard, and he just comes to your farm daily at a certain time, and if you've collected any thank you letters, he will put them in your mailbox. So here you can see that I didn't help anyone from this farm, so he just um, noted, he's a, he just said that there's nothing that I can put, and he went away. So Alfred also delivers all the packages to your farmhouse. So it's, he's been doing a really hard work since the very beginning, and I think we all should appreciate him. So this, as you can see, I'm just going to be collecting the thank you letters. And the thank you letters actually has gift cards inside them. You can have up to five gift cards maximum in a day. So let's get into more detail now. All right, guys, so the question is how you can give thank you letters. So when you see a sign of helping on other people's farms, you just have to go around and help them either with their boats, with their truck orders, or you can also help the town or tree revive. So for example, I'm at this farm and I'm just going to see how to do this. So it's a truck help, I can do this, there I go. And it's a boat help, oh, I need cherries, that's not cool. And, oh, we do have a tree revive as well. And I just got a booster. Let's get back to my farm, collect some cherries, and I'm going to come back to help them. So let's collect some cherries. I'm going to go back to see what happens. So there I go. I've just helped this person with three things. And I'm going to be showing you guys how will you get the thank you letters. All right, guys, so here you can see that the help sign, which means that the help has been done. So you can see the envelope sign over there, and we'll see the thank you letter sent to Haiti Every Day, which is, of course, me. And the same is with the truck order. You can see another thank you letter got sent to me, and another thank you letter got sent to me. So I got three thank you letters. But please remember the thank you letters will not be stored if you already have your mailbox full. So here you can see that Alfred came again, and he is gone now. So... I'm just going to be collecting all the gift cards here as well. There are a lot of gift packages you can also purchase. Now currently my mailbox is totally full and I cannot do anything. So what I'm going to do now, I'm going to be ordering these packages. I'm going to be showing you guys what do I get. So there I go with 10. And now you will also see that Alfred will come immediately at the moment when you order a package, a request. So, poor Alfred, he does a lot of work, even in such a hot summer, so I think he deserves an honor. And there he comes, slowly, 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 walking on the road. I never had a close look at his clothes and the bag that he's carrying. And he's, I think he's wearing glasses, what are those? Yeah, so 3, 2, 1, I'm going to be opening this package. Ooh, and I just got one golden voucher, which I think is totally worth it. But sadly, I need more green and blue vouchers, not the golden ones. And I'm going to be ordering this big package. But please, guys, make sure that you do not immediately um, ask for an order. 
once you've already done it because Alfred did not come. So once you see that he has gone away, then you order the next package because otherwise you will lost your um, gift cards because this happened with me once. Now I'm going to be ordering this one, which is a mystery package, and you can see that he's coming again. So Alfred, you're not going to stop now because you're going to work for me today. And I'm going to see how many, I've got only 11, so I think I can collect and I know I'm going to have tons. Oh my God. That's crazy. 35. Okay. Hopefully I can order a big package and see what do we get today. Now, Alfred not only delivers you these packages, but also when Haiti does updates, um, maintenance, or whenever they do some special kind of deliveries. For example, you get some cool prizes when you reach level 50, level 100, you get decorations. Also, when you win giveaways from Haiti YouTubers, they will give you diamonds. So Alfred will be the one who will deliver to you. So Alfred is like the, like the key of this game. He does all the work. Ooh, ice creams, six ice creams, cool. And now it's time to order the big mystery package or the large mystery package. And let's see what do we get now. Oh my God, thank God. I think he wasn't going to come back. And here he comes the third time. So I think he's also losing his weight because he's walking a lot, which I think is cool for all of us. So now I'm going to see what do I get. I'm so excited. And you guys can see that I only got five. And I will get more now once I help people all around the world. You can see that there are a lot of people asking for help. So make sure you go around and help them with their boats and trucks. In this way, you can have a lot of gift cards and thank you letters. So the thank you letters inside them has the gift cards, which you can use to purchase these packages. So I'm going to be seeing what do I get? Let's see. Uh, let's hope they are diamonds, but oh, mallets, four mallets, not cool. I don't need mallets. That's crazy because I don't really need them. And now Alfred is gone. Bye bye, Alfred. See you tomorrow. Have a good day. Oh, he just vanished. Did you guys see this? He just vanished like a superhero. Oh my God. Does he have mystical powers? Oh my God. So there's a close look at the animation of Alfred and you can see that he's wearing a hat that has a yellow color envelope sign on it, which indicates that he's a postman. And I've actually never had a close look at his a uniform before. So we're going to be seeing now you can see he's wearing a coat, a tie, a shirt, and he's carrying a bag and he's wearing black shoes. So it's a really cool animation. It actually looks like the real postman out there. And this is the smiley face of Alfred when he delivers you thank you letters in your mailbox. So he's saying have a good day. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Let me know in the comments what you guys think of Alfred. Do you like him or not? And subscribe if you want to see some more Haiti videos and I'll see you guys soon. Bye.